all right, um, not sure how to say this, but um, after a lot of consultation with my family and my staff, um, and it's with a very heavy heart, and it's something that I never thought I'd ever have to consider, but I just have to let you guys know that um, Beautiful Plumbing is closing down. It's home office. So, oh, sorry, did you think that it was closing down the whole business? I wonder where you got that impression. Maybe it was the title of the video or something like that. That's what they do in the journalism space. They call that clickbait. You know, so they have a story which is yes, got a little bit of truth to it, but then it's not the whole truth. Anyway, it is quite exciting. We've, we've decided that to take the next step and um, to try and move the business off site. G'day, I'm Ben from Beautiful Plumbing. So why does this next step have to happen now? Well, it all comes down to customer service. Um, I've always been focused on delivering better customer service. Yes, we make some mistakes sometimes, but we do our very best to make it right. So most people don't understand how horrible and frustrating it is when a tradie comes in and offers up cheap customer service. Now it's happened to me and my wife and it's, I don't know, very upsetting. Now you may be upset for a day or so, but I guarantee you'll get that same feeling when you walk back into that room and the floor on the you know, bathroom isn't, is, is falling the wrong way or the basin is off center or the, a hot water system was installed that doesn't suit your family's needs and you're stuck with it for the next 10 years. When our customers reflect back on the work that we've done, whether it's a week or a month or years later down the track, I really hope that they're glad that they called Beautiful Plumbing to help them out. So at Beautiful Plumbing, we hope that from the very first contact to the advice and the options that are given on site, right through to where we've completed the job and we're long gone, we really hope that our customers are, are pleased that they call Beautiful Plumbing for help. Do you know that there are different grades of customers? There's your A grade customer, right down to your D grade customer. And do you know there are hundreds of plumbers in Perth who would love to work for the A grade customers that we have? So I drive into my team that is an absolute privilege to work for A grade customers. And A grade customers should get A grade customer service. But here's the problem. Great customer service is not that common nowadays. So we're finding that there's growing demand for our plumbing services. So at the moment, um, I'm running the business out of home. Um, the office staff work in a small study and believe it or not, some days I haven't even got a desk I can use. So it's kind of impossible to grow. So one of the options I thought about is maybe setting up a workstation down here, get a desk and a monitor. You know, I have to move some motorbikes and lawn mowers and you know, sweep it out a bit, but be very hot in the summer and it'll be freezing oh, mate, in the winter. The complaining. Do you want some cheese with this one? Do you like your job? This one? Yeah, this one. Yeah, best job ever. Don't worry, mate, we'll find something. Thanks, mate. So what are we looking for in a warehouse? We'd like it to be 10, 15 minutes from home. So we're looking around, you know, Kewdale, Forestfield, um, Welsh Bull, High Wycombe, even Maddington or, or Kenwick or, or, or something like that. Um, we'd like it to be like 150 to 200 square metres. Um, yeah, with a large, a large office, so um, with preferably like a meeting room or something because, you know, we have to run staff meetings and especially toolbox meetings for safety and stuff like that. So that, that, would, be, that would be great. Um, also a separate toilet um, for the staff and also one for the office staff so the, the girls don't have to share the boys' toilet. That, that, would, be, that would be great. So there's been a growing demand in our caravan um, work that we do gas and water and, and things like that on them. So it would be great if um, we had a, you know, a higher roller door so we could fit some of the bigger van, vans in um, to get them out of the weather, get them out of the sun so we could work on them. If it had a hoist, that'd be great too, just to get the van up a little bit higher so it could make us you know, a little bit more efficient. So that's kind of what's on our, um, our wish list. So there isn't much around in warehouses at the moment. Um, there's some really horrible ones <laughs> that we've seen that um, my wife and my staff have just 
yeah, hated. There are some new ones on the market. They're in um, Canningvale and Bayswater, and they're, they're just beautiful, brand new, high ceiling, sort of everything, nice disabled toilets and stuff like that. But uh, just a little bit further from, from where we're based. They seem to sell really quickly. Um, there's some new ones that are going to be finished in about six months' time in Bayswater that we we're looking at as well. But I don't have to wait another six months before we um, sort of get get a unit. Anyway, the search begins for the new beautiful plumbing headquarters and hopefully we find something that ticks most of the boxes. We are going to try document um, as we move our home based business off site. So please come along with us for the ride. I just hope we find a, a warehouse in a couple of weeks. Um, you know, we might have to give it a lick of paint. I'm even open to a small bathroom renovation. I could put a new cupboard in uh, in, in the kitchenette, you know, sort of thing. Um, yeah, move some furniture in, get the internet connected, and then uh, bang, we're open for business. But seriously, I just want to give a special thanks to all our A-grade customers who have, have brought this on, because without your support, um, this wouldn't be happening, and, you know, there'd kind of be <laughs> no, no need for it. So on behalf of my family and my staff, um, I just want you to know that your support is very much um, appreciated. And hey, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, people. Like and subscribe and let this journey begin.